Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Moon Pressure Let's Plays. My name is Hecto, and today we're tackling Unsighted Episode 6, I think. Yeah. <laughs> today I've been recording several episodes, like from episode 4 onwards, I think. And I'm kind of not, not that up to date with the numbers, if you know what I mean. Ooh, we have some fishing spots here, immediately. There you go. Mm, medium lump. Well, the last, uh, the last ones like under the earth got me 500 volts per perfect catch. So maybe catching here above water, uh, above ground level is not that good of an idea. Maybe like rare, um, rare locations give you better bolt counts. Yeah, it seems that way. Wait, we never got the material thingy on this side. Yeah. Good, great. Um, then let's mosey over to the aquarium. Last time we found uh, the aquarium dungeon after uh, opening up a lot of the map and hitting on dead ends each and every time. I mean, we could also explore here, but um, I promised you guys the aquarium. So yeah, let's let's go over there. And try to see what we can do. Okay, I think we had to go down. Yes. physics. Oh my god. <laughs> this game just got a lot harder. Exploration log 4011. The situation here is critical. The entire aquarium has been frozen. The only automaton capable of such a thing would be Maria herself. She has probably, under, uh, probably gone unsighted as, at this point, just like the others. We fear that if she escapes from here, she'll freeze the surface as well, risking the entire ecosystem. Yeah, maybe my... Maybe my theory about the robots having to do something with the ecosystem is actually pretty spot on. Because like this, this log mentioned how, how Maria can affect the ecosystem. And I guess she was some sort of coolant unit, maybe? And we had the, the three faces robot, I forgot its name. And it was able to summon plants, and I said, yeah, maybe it has something to do with the biosphere or gardening, farming, something along those lines, at least originally before going unsighted. Okay, what do we have here? Oh, these start to crack. Nice. Okay. Aquarium exhibit lock. Marine research automaton model M4R14, so Maria. And the most advanced uh, deep sea exploration machine. Ah. So she's a deep sea exploration machine. Developed by Ice Core Industries. Using ice crystals and high pressure resisting alloys, Maria brought to the surface a whole new world for humans to explore. Unfortunately, after 20 years of service, the automaton has been deactivated, as Ice Core Industries shut down after whistleblowers revealed their misconduct with sewage. Oh, so maybe they are connected to, like, all the toxic gunk in the sewers? You remember where we met the, the big orca-looking guy that was... ...that was fishing? Oh, now we're actually in an aquarium! Yay! 
How are these fish still alive when there's no one here to feed them? Blackout corridor. Mm. Yep, no way. No way, no way. Let's see. Uh, so, not over here, then maybe. No. Have to re equip the grenade launcher. Oh, hello. I know you from my parry training with Master Cecilia. Master would be proud. <laughs> and the elemental blade kicks ass. I love it. Ugh. Not fast enough. puzzles. Little known facts to basically anyone but me. Um, oh no, Teresa has gone unsighted. Oh, poor Granny. I actually very much love ice puzzles, uh, at least in, in Zelda games. And also I played, what was the game again? Ruins of Tessos or something? I think that was just a subtitle, but it was like um, a roguelike, Zelda-like mixture of a game. And that one has had Icebox puzzles as well. I, I very much enjoy them. It's probably a good idea to go front first. Yeah, I could go over there, but there just seems to be... Ouch. A locked door, yeah. But we can go here. Good, not good. Let's see if we manage to survive, or if I manage to survive, more like you're not on the controller. So, yeah. Oh, Frogger. Old school, aren't we? Close, but no cigar. Once again. Now. Oh, that was close. Is there something down here? Uh, not like this. Like this. Yes, there is actually. Okay, let's just look up here, what we can find here. Some broken instructions. So maybe not. I'm scared. That was close. Yes. The chest is ours. Our first key. Nice. Okay, that was very much worth it coming here. Oh, that was not. This is Exploration Log 4022. We've suffered many losses here. We weren't ready for this environment and for this many unsighted. We were not able to defeat Maria in this state. We'll have to find another solution. Mm, anything?
anything here? Doesn't seem like it. No. Wait, that means a pin here? Yeah. God damn it. Max focus here. Juicy. Okay, before we head through this door, we still have these things left, so... The door seems like the obvious way forward. Oh, the merchant. Hello. Hey, we meet again. We meet again. We, I've got all kinds of stuff. From oh yeah, yeah, it's it's the standard di dialogue. Petberry. One petberry for forty bolts. Are you insane, good sir? No, he just has the same. Boring stuff every time. But I saw a fishing spot here. Perfect. Oh, and the dick side. No, nothing too good. Able to go here, right? Yeah. I'm not seeing anything, even though. Didn't, didn't the map say there's. Oh no, no, the exit is way over here. Okay. So let's put a pin here. And go through the door. I saw that the, the, that the path from the crossroads also leads to wherever behind the door is. Oh wait, wrong way. But I'm guessing they wouldn't design it so that the keys are unnecessary. So let's just use it here. Who knows what we'll find. Frozen nest. Genius. Ouch. Okay. The middle one was two, the right one was five. Is five. Let's just like, note this down real quick. So we have to find all of them. Okay, I, I hope it was the middle one that was number two, but yeah, I'm not sure. Okay, another log. Exploration log 4008. Yeah, I've not been reading them in order, have I? There are hints spread all across the aquarium, apparently for some kind of numeric order puzzle. We're taking notes on them. Great minds think alike, <laughs> if I might say. <laughs> you never know, might be useful later. Did we come from up here? No, we did not. Blackout room. Okay, was that it? Is there still someone else here? Uh, we ah uh, we have to we have to push the block over there. I should probably heal myself. You can re-enter this room to reactivate blocks you've destroyed. Okay. We're making our own barriers here, I think. Well, this one has to go most certainly, because otherwise nothing would get through here. Okay. 
Okay. Down you go. And before I push you to the side, where would you end up? Here. And that is good. Yes, we want that. Now we can destroy both of them. Um, no, like this. Like this. And this. Ah, there you go. There you go. Up to the side. And down. Thank you very much. Another key. You know, guys. I'm still curious what's behind the mystery door that I skipped over at the very beginning of the game. Oh, uh, I guess we can we can get the key from from Ar uh, Anna for it, right? Anna was the shopkeep's name, I think. But yeah, I I, I kind of regret skipping over skipping over it. I don't know if it if it's just an alternate route, or if there was actually some kind of secret behind it, and I accidentally used the right door first. Yeah, let's just continue. Open sesame. Frozen waterway. Ah, oh, yeah, the, this is where we would have come out at the crossroads from here, okay. Oh, that did not work? Okay. Let's try that again. Oh, what, what's happening? Did I stub my toe on it? Ah, no. Oh, an attack cog. No, I actually would not like to dismember it. I would like to dismember one of these reload cogs. They seem great, but I don't need more than one. Oh no, not, do not activate it. I want to destroy it. Yes, because the attack cog was kind of useful for the boss. You got an attack cog. Nothing down there, okay. Exploration Log 4023. Our battle with Maria ended. We weren't able to get the meteor shard. With the last of our efforts, we locked her away in the deepest room of the aquarium. She's weakened, and with proper reinforcements, we might be able to defeat her. If someone rece receives this message, please come and help us. Oh, I guess it's a bit late for that, pal. Well, you tried, buddy. Oh, 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 this looks like a mini-boss. Where was our last terminal? Oh, oh, wait, it's right here. Over the elevator. And yeah, then we can go right back here. Excuse me for a second, I have to sneeze. Sorry about that. Maybe the grenade launcher is important. I will keep my elemental blade for the time being. And let's just look and see. Mm, not like this. Ah, like this. Not like this. But I I can I cannot parry. I cannot parry this one. Oh! Did not expect him to be able to fire behind his body. I probably should have should have jumped over it.
Yeah, now she can get me syringes, but only for th for some meteor dust. Yeah, I know where she is. And I do not have meteor dust because I'm keeping your ass alive, Iris. Don't have enough for any chip slots, strength chip, etc. We'll find any. Maybe unequip the syringe chip. I probably won't be able to to do anything with it. Defense chip would be nice, but no, I don't can't afford that. Maybe the white chip. No, 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 makes no sense. Just just two health chips. Yeah. Like this. Oh, now I have to recharge. Okay, let's go down. Uh, yeah, meet you in the boss room in a sec. Okay, guys and girls, I'm back. Okay, what's our strategy for this? I obviously am able to damage the claws. But I need to have perfect parry timing for it. And yeah, I do not have that at the moment. The shuriken is useless here. Maybe the shotgun? Um, I also need to remember to switch to Raquel's axe when, when I get a parry off. Yeah, let's just try it again and probably need to train a bit more on the timing. Well, perfect. Oh, not like this. Okay, he's a bit too fast for me to be using the, the axe, I think. have to be faster as well. Maybe use a revive cog, but then I don't have one left. Well, then I then I don't have two left for the boss. I think the boss will be pretty hefty. But it's not so bad. This boss can definitely be beaten. I just hate that I'm on a time limit and thus forced to like to like rush I can't take my time with this as I normally would have okay see you in a sec and we're back hello uh, not like this not like this either, this was too late. Yeah, he's always destroying the the stage with 
with this with this move. The block timing is so hard! It's so difficult! At least one? Oh no, the floor regenerates. That's good. At least something. I don't have to worry about. Number one? Goes for a second core. Down. And critical. Okay. Like this. Oh, I'm on the wrong side of the wall. Uh, at least deal some damage to him. Normally I want to take out his claw first. Yes, like this. Okay. That was a misplay. Pure misplay on my part. What, what was that? Bastard have contact damage or what? It seems that way, but I'll go back to the elemental blade. This is not not great. Yeah. Now he just repeats this cycle. Um, get down here. going well so far. This isn't... Oh god. Oh, my stamina. Wrong direction. Okay, can actually jump over it. Nice. Yay, I used the spin attack for like the first time in forever. Arthropod King, Arthropod King Claudius was his name. Hmm. Well, in this world, all robots have like sapiens, right? So probably this crab monster thing had sapiens as well. You got ice grenade. Use it to create platforms in the water. Equip it in the pause menu. Significantly weaker, but has more ammo. Great. Hey, why don't you try using some ice grenades on those blocks? It's a grenade after all. It should smash them to pieces. Should it? I don't know how he got to that conclusion, but oh well. Yeah, it does. Okay, now that we have the dungeon item... These pins mean nothing anymore, I can't already delete them. 
because the 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 unfinished runes show us that we haven't been there yet. Frozen office. significantly more difficult to, to parry on the ice because like you slide away from the enemy and then that makes your parry timing be off. Oh uh, yes the map Sector map downloaded check your map screen. Oh and we have some coral down out there. Well for being accused of polluting the world uh, this aquarium looks surprisingly clean. I mean, coral can't really survive on toxic water, right? So... There's that. <sighs> Precision platforming. Oh, and some meteor dust, yes. No! Damn it! This is not easy. As you might have imagined, platforming is not my forte, especially if, if you have read my channel description. Oh, there's nothing here, okay. Wait, can we do something in this room? Locked door. Genius. Even more genius. I'm going to die here, aren't I? Uh, maybe not. Whatever, that's it. Ah, this, this changes the direction, oh my god, this would have been so much easier. Is there something? Oh, it's just the door. Okay, and we have a door down here. And an elevator back to the terminal. These are important items. There's more than one in this dungeon? Okay. Interesting. So we probably should go here and then down here first because this is a dead end. Wait, there's like an info board over there. Leftmost one is the first one. Oh, thank you. This was actually required. Another hint for our number puzzle. Maybe I should go upstairs and recharge for a bit. Get our syringe back. I'm just, I'm just imagining like a few hundred thousand years ago, whenever the humans and the automatons were still were, were still friends, that like uh, this was just the the whole number thing was just like a search game for tourists and children, and that would be fun. Was there something here? No, just this. Maybe not. Left and then down. Okay. Blackout corridor. Oh yes, we have meteor dust. Oh, 
love to see it. But it's behind the wall. Like this. Great. Media dust. We probably have enough to, to give Iris another one. Give Meteor Dust to Iris, yes. Uh, yeah, she, she, she says the same. And maybe another one, because like we want to keep Iris around, right? So... Might as well get her to maximum. Hey, Alma. I just want to say that. You're probably the best friend I've ever had. Oh. Thank you so much for caring about me. I've been thinking that I can help you more since I've been do you've been doing so much for me. Hey Iris, it's okay. You don't have to push yourself. No, really, it's fine, Alma. I used to be very afraid of other automatons, especially the unsighted. But I'll try to fight side by side with you from now on. Oh great! And I mean really fight, you know? <laughs> totally smack someone's sight next time we see him. I'm not afraid anymore. Thanks, Iris. But be careful. Great! So she's actually like an attack companion now. Great, she, she probably will do just one damage, but I appreciate you anyways, Iris. I appreciate you anyways. See what we can find. Whatever this important item is. Well, this at least. Exploration log 4015. Quickly reloading the ice grenade surely helps when nav navigating environments, and environments around here. Pressing the reload trigger again at the right time while reloading is the trick for a quick reload. Yeah, we knew that already. And look at me mess it up immediately. Oh, this is the important item, I guess. Oh yes, keys! Okay, keys count as important items in this in this realm. Makes sense. Anything else here? Oh, it doesn't seem like it. Ugh. Oh, here there is! Nice. Come to Papa. do not really enjoy this background track, I must say. It's a bit too calm, if you know what I mean. Okay, so go over here, get this. But we have so many rooms that are not part of the dungeon that we can explore now. I want to go to them first. Yeah, so let's let's hold off on the proper path for a little while longer. These are probably exits. Maybe we can unlock sh some shortcuts. Frozen sewers area and more fishing spots. Question mark. This was fast. Ooh, the elemental blade really takes it out of you. Thank god for these stamina chips, otherwise I probably would not be able to use it properly. Um, that's not really that important, to me at least. Question mark. Okay, a long one this time. Perfect. Um, just 100 bolts. Okay, we can go over the water here now. Let's just look what's up here. We are in the uh, suburbs again. And uh, let's look and see. Okay, we're here. C 
could we not reach this one earlier? Or was it was it broken down? Well, I I saw that there was a meteor dust somewhere up here. No, there wasn't. Okay, could have sworn I, I saw I saw the the ping for it. Oh, yes, there is. I just have to go through this shadowy area here. Hello. Treasure. You got meteor dust. Increasing the automaton's time by 24 hours. Always appreciated. Okay. That paid off immediately. Let's go back down. the ping up left oh yeah there, she did something there I saw it oh she's so cool she has like this little saber I mean she only does Three damage, but who cares? That's sick as sick as hell. I love it. She reminds me of of one of the personas from Persona 4. I I won't say which characters in case someone hasn't played that game yet, and I won't spoil it. But one of the characters has, has like a small insect-like persona who also has like a lightsaber attached to its arm, and it's rad as hell. Speaking of red, fishing or not. Perfect. Look at how far I've come from messing up the fishing every single time. Okay. Wait a second. We did go here. Sorry. Sidetracking Hecto sidetracks again. Oh no, it's, it's put down here. These respawn pretty much immediately, right? So. Yeah, probably not a good idea to do this all the time. this right? Yeah, it is. Okay, great. Central room. Oh god, another Cthulhu. Oh my, look out! It's that thing again. Oh, this lo room looks infested. Okay. Let's equip Raquel's axe. I guess the grenades don't matter either way. Mm, yeah, let's try it. Oh god, I hope I don't die. One, two, three. No, no. Ouch. One, two, three. get flame blade blueprint hmm I mean we already have the elemental blade so pretty useless but oh, oh well it, uh, may, maybe the flame blade is better than the elemental blade but like doesn't apply as many status effects I could imagine that so yeah could be Well, a normal let's play, that would be something I would ask the comments. But... No such luck. Not with my setup. 
the setup won't change, at least for unsighted. The future might be something different, but not right now. Oh, a terminal. Great. Still can't buy another chip. But we can recharge. Great. Recharge complete. Perfect catch. You got blazing axe? I got a whole axe. Okay, uh, I guess we can immediately uh, compare the axes. Oh yeah, it's better than my war axe and it is the exact same as Raquel's axe. I'm 2218. Raquel's axe is 2418, so Raquel's axe is better but has no, has no fire effect. Well, that was a lucky catch. Maybe someone is actually weak to... Ooh, what's this, a maze? Maybe someone is actually weak to... to a certain element. And then we can... Oh, this opens this up, but closes the other one down. Ouch. This one up there. Wait, 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 we can do this with. I hope I'm not self soft locking myself with this, but yeah, it should be possible. It is. Great. Blazing X blueprint. Useful. Not. Oh, it's this entire. This entire shebang, right? So... Um. Yeah, Iris, get him! like a sniper taking his shot. <laughs> this is kind of nerve-wracking sometimes. Wait, have we been here before? Yes, and we came out where? Oh, this was, wasn't actually closed off, it was just like... Wait, then why is here a pin? Is there a pin here? I don't know. Hmm. Look and see what we can find. Oh. I spy with my little eye. Meteorite dust chest. Let's look up here. What's this? I saw your chests, but I can't go up here. Where is there a... But I can get up here. Mm, doesn't really seem to be useful. So I probably need to switch down here somewhere. Mm, where's the next... Ah, here. Okay. So, probably like this. Oh. Genius. Okay. And... Wait. I think I can do this. Like this, and then immediately back again. Great. Meteor dust. Okay, now we can get up here. That paid off immediately again. Okay. 
probably no way to get over here without flying. Nope. At least I think we'll be able to fly at some point. Because what else could it be? Oh, that was too early. And this is... I don't know. And we've already been here, so just the northern exit is what's important now. Northern exit. Oh, right next to us. Okay. And one more time for good measure. Is this game from Japan? I don't think so, because like these days every video game from Japan has has a fishing mini game in it. And some of the time they are even pretty good. Ouch, no stamina. Been in this room before? No. Oh, but we, we looped around uh, the entire way, so yeah. Oh, and here's an exit back to this area. So maybe you can get into the museum district from here? I, I don't know. No, this is too, too low. It's the doctor's lab, doctor's room. Oh, this is this is the starting area, okay. Which we still did not completely explore. But yeah, we can get through here and then back here, probably. Sorry for all the sidetracking, but you know you know how it is. You know me by now, I hope. At least somewhat. Torchip! Ooh! Yes! Yes, indeed! I I would like that! Well, what else is here? We can go back here and unlock the elevator or we'll go up north. So many paths to choose from! Oh, oh, oh. No. Oh well. Wait, was there another ping down there somewhere? Oh yes, there was. Hello? Hmm, I'm stupid. Reload your weapons. And another meteor dust, we're killing it. Okay, now that we're here, it's probably better to, like, check out the, the elevator room here. Oh. Is this another ice puzzle? Oh, we have this up here. No, we cannot. From here with the shuriken? Nope. Still too too far down and the chest will probably only be reachable with Right. 
Let's just do this, we can reset it anyways. Yeah. Okay, great. Now we need to reset. If I could aim. Okay, how are we going to do this? We just have to push this one out, right? And... No, no. I wanted to push the block I was standing in front of, not the one I... Uh. Second platform that I have to activate? No. Okay. Barely make that jump. Secret courtyard. Ooh, no step on. Thank you, Iris. You're a dear. Another one. Frostbite equipped in the past menu. Is that a sword? Frostbite. A blade of winter. Yes, it is. Okay. It will be interesting to see if this blade can actually, like, affect. Oh, we're here! If that blade can actually affect the water, like if I can just slash at something and... And, like, uh, slash at water and create platforms. That's why I will actually take it with me for just a second until we encounter water again. And we can get over here now. And I can heal most, most importantly. But where's my block? Did I actually miss something here? Yeah, we're back here in front of the museum again. Ouch. Did I actually miss something? Maybe? But I don't know. We needed to get up here, right? At least from some... I'm so stupid. I am so stupid. Oh god, I hate myself right now and you must hate me too. Oh god, you, you were screaming at the, uh, from, at the void from, from the vo void at me, right? Oh, this, this was not hard at all. Okay, so that is primed. And what is this? Main hall, second floor. Okay, excursion into a different dungeon, but yeah. Let's just get this chest here. Reload cog blueprint. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. And nothing we can do there. Okay, great. Mm, there probably should be an entrance like this on the other side as well. 
Maybe? No? No, it doesn't seem that way. now open as well, right? Yeah. I never removed the removed the pins. So this is open as well. Great, then let's just take a gander in the into the museum, get the first terminal. And yeah. We can upgrade our chip slots again. That's good. Please, thank you. Okay, then let's unequip those heal chips and maybe get a defense chip. Yeah. Oh, let's let's just get this quickly. And then leave again because like I don't want to split the dungeons over overly much. Meteor dust. Right. Okay. And once again over to this teleporter. Oh yeah, let's try out the frost blade. Nope. Okay, guys, let me just look at the time for a second. Mm, yeah, we have like I've been recording for an hour and 5 minutes, so yeah, probably should think about ending the episode soon. Kind of bums me out that we did not manage to get through all of the dungeon. Mm, let's do a few more rooms. Northern ele elevator. Is there something behind here? Yes, there is! Thought you could hide from me, did you? Also great. Oh, that was a big leap. Okay, where are we? Over here. Okay, we can at least un unlock the... Oh no, that was just because of the water, I think, so... Yeah, at least it looks like it. Let's just go over here for a second. Look at this. Yeah, looks like it. Hmm. Yeah, we would be going back here. Now we can choose where we want to go first. The locked door probably makes more sense. Path to the side here? Yes. Mm, we never did that. Oh well. Uh, no, I don't want that. I want to go down here. And bottom. Sorry, uh, you, you guys realize my sense of direction is horrifically poor. So much so that my friends tease me constantly about it. Oh, we can't go here. Yeah, that's why I'm looking so much at, at the map. Thank 
you. Is there something behind the waterfall? No, it isn't. So, no choice but to go through this door, then... Oh yeah, I'm, I'm stupid. Well, obviously, the last important item is probably the Meteor Shard I itself, right? Damn it. Ouch. Let's move it on. North Fish Tank. Okay, yeah, this looks more polluted. Now. One, two, and down you go. Another lock puzzle? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Before we destroy anything, let's just take a look around. Oh no. What is this? No, no way. What is over here? Nothing except an elevator. Could like send a block down here, but why would we do that? Because that's what the what obviously what this slot here is for. Oh, we came from here. Okay. Yeah, but why would we do that? We could also send this block here. Do they want us to do that? Can I can I even climb this? Yes, I can, so... Let's just try, we can always reset. Down... To the side... Up... We have to push it down the other way, don't, don't we? Like this? Yes. Okay. Oh, this is the the elevator. Mm, I am in a moral quandary right now because I kind of want to go up here first. Where would that even lead? To somewhere unknown. Yeah. Oh. Of the puzzle. Oh, wait, six? There, they were. There were three on each side. Okay, I thought there were only five. Oh, I hope this doesn't mess up my calculations. Now I don't know where two is anymore. But yeah. Exploration log four zero one six. Starting our experiments with the ice shuriken. Ice shuriken. Olga sent us the blueprints yesterday. It seems more efficient than the ice grenades when it comes to navigating the environment, but it's a lot harder to control. The ice shuriken. So we can make a shuriken out of ice? Where are we? We are here. Okay, let's just remove this. Um, there is something... Right. The gates are closed, okay. Oh, this is the boss room. Yeah, I saw it right there. Let's continue on here. Okay, an ice shuriken. Let's let's think about that once we return to once we return to the the garden or the village, whatever it was called. Destroy 
this one as well. Like that. And now probably like this. And then... This? Oh no, I, I messed up, didn't I? Oh no, not, not finally, but... Because I cannot actually go to the other side there. So, should I do this? And now... Like this... This... And this, maybe? But how would that help me? I clearly wanted to go... Somewhere around here. Oh, I have to put one block here. Okay, and the other one... I have to push it from the bottom to to there. so far, but how do I get this one here? I need to get it get it to here so that I can push it downwards. Hmm, big thunk. So once it's up here, it can't, can't be in that side. Wait, maybe like this and this. Does that help me in any way, shape or form? Yes, it does. Like this, like this, and like this. Great. Another victory for logic. Ah, now I can get up here. Why would I want that? Absolutely genius. What was even over here? Wait, we've already been here. What was the point of that? I mean, okay, we could not have gone this way. What is the waterfall? This? And then... Yeah, there's nothing down there, so... This, I guess this is the water direction? No, it is not. It just closes that part off. Which suits our purposes just fine, because we don't need to go there anyways. Jesus Christ. Reloading. The cracks in the glass don't really make me trust this aquarium. Zero out of ten bad bad Yelp review or wherever you give tourism reviews. I'm not an American, so I don't really know. Have we been here before? No, we have not. Okay, this is the boss room here, right here. And so, oh, there's another locked door, but where is another chest with a key? I don't see one. Power room. Hmm. No blood puzzle. 
Kills. Yay, these are great. Mm, but no way to to change these ones, so they are permanent, I guess. Probably, maybe. Over here is just the locked door, right? Yeah, seems that way. Something down here. No, only another block door. Hmm, okay, let's tackle this puzzle here. The first one doesn't seem so bad, but you probably need to consider that you only have two sphere, uh, two, two thingies, so yeah, not that great. need to escort one block all the way around probably yeah like like that oh wait open sesame like this okay then get this one through here and do I need this one block Still... No, not really. Okay, I can just... Oh. Like this. This. And this. Then this one over here. Through here. And now what? Yeah, I can put it over there, but like I still need to get this one out of here. So like this. And no, no, that does not work. Yeah, like that. Oh yeah, I need to block it here, so. Thank God, I, I, I at least kind of like these puzzles. Yeah, I, I actually quite enjoy them, so... Otherwise, you would be suffering much, much more. Once I played... Virtue's Last Reward, for the, these are, they are these ex escape room games. And... Yeah, uh, there's one type of puzzle where you... Push a button that changes the state of the button and all the buttons around it and your your goal is you have to light up an entire board i am horrendous at these kinds of puzzles like you know you switch one button off all the other ones around it are also switch on and if one is already on it switches off like that okay nothing here anymore except the door We are closing in on the boss and have this as well. East Courtyard. Hello, my good sir. Question mark. Hello there. Oh, I forgot his voice. Um, hey there. How's your fishing going? Found anything yet? I can sell you some of the trash I found on the water. I could offer meteor dusts, but I don't know how much I have. 
And yeah, he's just like a, a trash salesman. Wait, where are we? Aquarium courtyards? We have seven meteor dust. Oh, I could max him out. But I, do I want that? Uh, whatever he's going to give me is, has probably to do with fishing. So I don't know. The, like, fishing is nice and all, but it doesn't solve all your problems. Maybe I'll hold off on that. Wait, where is he in our contacts? Oh, the smith has not too many hours remaining. Yeah, I... I'll probably keep my my thingies and Eliza as well. Oh, we can go to Eliza and max her out and she will give us another syringe. She said so. Yeah, let's do that shortly. Wait, where are we? Somewhere over here? Do we need to unlock... A shortcut here somewhere? No, it doesn't seem like it, but... We also have this. How do we get there? Not like that. Yeah, we have the statue, but like it's still connected to... Yeah, normally we would jump up here. But no way. Maybe once the boss is dead, the statue will die as well. Hmm. Okay, here's what we're going to do. The boss room is coming up, but we're saving that for the next time. I'll just go to Eliza. And after that to the upgrade guy. And max them out real quick. And yeah, see you guys in a sec. Okay, we have arrived. Hello, Eliza. Not here to waste my time. Is this for me? For me? I owe you one, kid. She kind of had a German accent, right? Like, an over-exaggerated one. Hey, since you've been so kind to me, I'll give you this. It's something I've been tinkering with lately. I hope it is useful to you. Thanks, Eliza. You're so kind. Hey, don't get used to it. Auto syringe chip. Oh, this is not a new syringe. Okay. Oh, oh, I, I did a bad, I think. Syringe blueprint. Mm, nah. Nah, maybe not. Okay. Hmm. Okay, yeah. Uh, back to the village and just offer one meteor dust to the smith so that he doesn't die immediately. Okay, back in Gear Village. Let's help our smithy friend out. Oh wait, we can probably get another one of the meteor dusts up here with this. Great. Genius. We can give him two. Hello, my good man. 
Here, have some meteor dust so that you don't die. Have some meteor dust. Let's upgrade our elemental blade. We cannot upgrade our elemental blade. But we could upgrade Rockwell's axe. Mm, nah, not yet. Hello, Oma. Olga. Uh, hey, Oma. Blah. Ah, fiddlesticks. I didn't uh, ask Eliza about Varna. Should have done that. And I normally would do that if I had infinite time. Ugh, I hate the time limit so much. Okay, back to the underground, back for more. So yeah, guys, uh, I guess I'll end it here. And this was Moon Pressure Let's Plays with Unsighted Episode 6, I think, I hope. Yeah, see you in the next one, I guess.